Okay, I'm going to teach you how to uh, download music from the CalvinVolrath.com. What you have to do is, I'm sure you're there already, uh, but go to CalvinVolrath.com. I'm certain you're already there. Now you can see across the top here, you can see home, profile, all these buttons. Volmart, this is a store where we keep a whole bunch of things. Volmart MP3, this is where we download music. MP3 is uh, is the audio. I have them organized from years, 2014 to 2017. So if you're looking for something in the last few years, there you go, uh, 2010 to 13. And then we have different... Uh, traditional and country and swing music and this is all instrumental live kitchen parties and on and on and on Christmas albums gospel waltzes themed recordings down here let's say you're looking for something from uh, the new album from this year for example so we click on 2014 2017 we we'll let that open up scroll down and here it is me myself and I audio recording you'll see right beside here uh, audio and book. This is where you get the audio and the music book to go along with it. $25.88. Cheap, cheap, cheap. What a deal. Only at Walmart. But if you just want the audio recording, here it is right here for $16.99. How do we do it at this price? I don't know. Here we go. Click. And look at there, there our shop, shopping cart appears, and there's me, myself, and I. DD means digital download. If we want to check out, we click on check out. But maybe you go, well, I would like maybe like something else. I heard this one's a good one, a fiddle of this, a fiddle of that. Well, let's click on the download. And look at that, you threw that right into your shopping cart. Ah, you changed your mind, you don't want it. Delete it. If all of a sudden you wanted to go to a different year and get something, one of these country or swing uh, instrumentals, you click on that, let that page open up, and look, here's your shopping cart, still there. And oh yeah, vintage Volrad, look, oh fool such as I, you don't know me, it's four in the morning, I guess. Click download, and there it's thrown into your cart. But we're going to delete that right now, and you can just keep going on and on with more albums as much as you want. Let's click check out. Now we're going to the we're going out to the checkout lady and the checkout lady is called PayPal. This is a virtual bank used worldwide, very very safe. If you have a PayPal account, uh, you would sign in here with your email address and use your password. So if you have a P PayPal account, you'll know exactly what to do. If you don't have a PayPal PayPal account, Scroll down to the bottom, pay with credit card or Visa debit. So I'm going to click on that because I'm guessing maybe that's what you're going to want to do. So here we go. So now it says you're going to be charged $17.84 because they throw the tax on it. And we type in our credit card number. That's what you should be doing. And then the expiry date. Whoops. And the CSC, that's the three digits you find on the back of the card. Put in your name. Make sure you're very careful when you're typing in all this stuff in. Just because. You want to make sure that you get it. Click on city, type in your city. I live in a small town, but we still call it a city in this instance. My province, your postal code, you do all that. Shipping method, don't worry about shipping method. You're going to get a download code after you press continue at the bottom. So just leave that alone. Here they want your contact information. And so you have your choice to choose mobile or home or work, whatever you want. I'll put in my mobile number. And then your email address. Make sure you're very careful when you type that in because there's going to be two different ways for you to get the download code. And one of them is with the email address. So there's my email address. And now I confirm that I agree to PayPal's privacy policy. Yes, click that. 
my email address is correct. I'm checking one more time and I'm going to click continue. Now I'm hoping everything is all okay. Hoping my credit, look at that. You paid $17.84 to Calvin Volrath Music. It says I paid with my uh, credit card and we're going to send a confirmation and click to return to merchant. I'm going to click on that and you get this. One moment please and you're going to get this window that opens up and here's your download. This is a little message here. It says you've just purchased audio, video, or sheet music, or whatever, asking you not to share it uh, with your friends. If you want, if they would like some music from CalvinVolrad.com, please send them to the website as you've done to purchase. Thank you kindly. So now uh, we're going to click download now. I'm on a PC, so it's asking me to save the file or open. You want to save it. You, have, you may have a window that opens up that says save file or save as. If you get the option to save as, I would do that. And then it's going to ask you where you want to save it. I know with my computer, I'm going to get that here. So now I'm saving it. I'm going to save this in my music folder. And here I think I'm going to right click on music fold, on that music folder and scroll down to where it says new, I'm going to say new folder and I'm going to write, I'm going to name that new folder Calvin Volrath, okay? Then hit my enter button and you'll see on the right hand side here a Calvin Volrath or it's also on the left. I'm going to right click that and I'm going to go new folder again and inside the Calvin Volrath folder I'm going to call this me, myself, and I and I'll put digital download okay so we there we go so we, we're going to save that music right there so click save okay so right now that music here I'm on uh, Firefox it's called that's the name of my browser I can just click on that look at that it says it is completed so I know that that's done so I'm now going to scroll down to the bottom of my computer where I get this. This is where I find all my files and all my folders. So I saved it in music. So I'm going to scroll to music. I know I saved it in Calvin Volrath and I saved it in me, myself and I. Now you see me, myself and I in digital download zip. We can't look at zip files. We can't listen to them. Zip means they've compressed the files to ship them to you over the internet in a smaller form. Now we need to unzip that. So I'm going to double click it. And when I double click it, I get this folder. It says extract. So that's to open it up. So it's going to extract that. And this is where it's asking, where is it going to copy that? So into Calvin, the music Calvin, or me, myself, digital, I, digital download. So I'm going to say yes. So right now it's unpacking that suitcase. So there we go. I'm going to close that up. And here it is right here. I'm going to double click on that. And there we have. We have a cover picture. We got the PDF down here. I'll just, I'll just show you. Here's the cover picture. Me, myself, and I. Down here is a PDF with all the, all the information you'll the, the the credits, the names of the tunes, the time, who played on the album. Okay, so there they all are. And here's all the tunes. You can see the names of it. Cal Paravase is on and on and on and on and on. So now we know where they are. I'm going to close this up. I'm going to close this up. And I'm going to go down here to find my iTunes. So I have, I'm going to open up iTunes. Here it is. So now on my iTunes, I'm going to go to File. And it says add folder to library. So now we need to find the folder. And where did we put it? We put it in music. We put it in Calvin Volrath. Me, myself, and I. And here it is right there. Digital download. It's not the zip one. So we just highlight that and select folder. And watch what happens. And there it is. It's now in my iTunes. There it is right there. Comes with the picture, all the tunes. Let's just have a listen to see if it's going to work. There it is. That's pretty slick. So now what you do is you take your iPhone or your iPod, your 
iPad, whatever you have, and you plug it into your computer with the USB cable. Your iTunes is opened up here. You'll see right over here. Uh, you'll your iPhone or whatever you've plugged in will uh, come on. This is not the computer I use for my iPhone, so I can't plug it in. But I would click on right about here. You'll see a little iPhone or an iPad. You click on that and uh, click on music somewhere down here and make sure that you have uh, Calvin Volrath's name uh, highlighted or give it a check mark so it knows to sync these, uh, these, uh, this music here, this album with. And then you go down to the bottom of your iTunes and click sync or whatever they put down there. And there you go. That's how you download music and get it into your iPhone. Have fun.